how can how can HR help the business identify and prioritize the critical skills it needs for the future? Knee-jerk reaction would be um, that I've seen a lot of companies, right, not a lot, I've seen a couple of companies be really successful and not trying to um, Descri- it's, a, it's a very hard to describe moving target, like which skills do we need in the future. Um, I see I see some successful companies rather focusing on um, like a proxy for that question, which is which skills could we use more of today? Um, and typically the answer is very similar, but it's a lot it's a lot easier to to grasp. Um, I think probably every person and every team can answer this. Like, hey. If you could clone one person in your team, uh, who would it be? Like, w- would you like a second David Green or uh, would you like a second uh, person X? Um, at one big energy company, uh, they kind of um, proxied for uh, like the skill demand by just looking at okay, like which which internal roles, like from all of our roles, which roles couldn't we uh, backfill internally right now? So for everybody in the organization, like if this person left, um, like for which of those roles wouldn't we have enough candidates to like backfill the entire function? And they just like bundled all those skills and said, look, this this is what we need more of. Um, so I'm not sure. I look, it's a very elaborate answer to a very simple question. So I apologize for that. But I'm not sure if we if we should focus too much on like trying to predict the future and like, hey, which skills will we need in five years time? Um, I think we should rather focus on like, hey, if we if we had a like a shopping budget and we could shop extra skills today, like which ones would we be acquiring? Um, because the like the end the, the end goal might be, be somewhat different, but the direction will definitely be uh, pretty much the same. Um, and it's a lot easier uh, to answer that question. In this series, we will be speaking to a range of senior leaders who are pushing a data-driven and digital HR agenda. Make sure that you subscribe via your podcast app of choice and also via our YouTube channel for free and regular interviews with the digital HR leaders of the future.